What's good? It's Chigozi. It's Sunday, December 9th, 2018. I was asked to look into Steven Hillenberg's death, and I also saw this as well when it happened. I just haven't talked about it. But, go to my video from the 26th. I don't know which video it was, but I said, I said November 27th is a very good day for them to report a death. I just predicted this perfectly. It was too good to be true. It was the 27th, think of the 27th club. It was the date with 76 numerology, blood sacrifice 76. It was the 331st day of the year, 331's the 67th prime, blood sacrifice 67. Death, killing, and murder all equal 38. It was the date with 38 numerology, and it was the date with 34 days remaining, murder 34. And this was the key part. You see how you compare the immutable factors with the mutable factors. What never changes is that, you know, not counting leap years, it's always a date with 34 days remaining. It's always the 331st day of the year. It always has a date with 38 numerology. It's always the 27th. So, what do they add in there? What changes based on the year? 76 now, because we get 11 plus 27 plus 20 plus 18. Next year, it's going to be a date with 77 numerology. So this factor here is what really sealed the deal as in how will they not report death of something pretty major. And they did. The creator of SpongeBob SquarePants died the 26, killed 26, but they reported the death the next day. You can even see the published date in this propaganda. SpongeBob SquarePants, we'll see what that sums to. 105. Masonry 105, that's also just 15. They update this propaganda at 150. When you write out 15, you get 38, like death, killing, murder. You also get 34. And again, that was a date with 38, 34 numerology. So if you're new to this channel, I hope you understand that there are patterns in how they code the numbers. And you see the same patterns throughout all of their propaganda. Steven Hillenberg, if he didn't fake his death, he was ritualistically sacrificed by the federal government. Those were his employers. SpongeBob SquarePants is a government entity. It is a show from the government. It is federal government entertainment. People are always talking about, you know, North Korea, everything's from the government. And, you know, when people say that, it shows how ignorant and retarded they are. Because they don't understand that their government's exact same. Everything they do is from the government for the most, very most part. You know, SpongeBob SquarePants. SpongeBob alone. Let's see what his name sums to. We're just gonna, you know, get some of these numbers out. SpongeBob ninety-five forty-one one forty-eight forty. Kill fifty-nine reflection. Zionist forty circle forty. 41 to 13th prime. What I want to do then is see how many days from his birthday did he die. This thing was in tribute to some historical event, something deeper. There's always a deeper riddle to this. But I was like, I would like to just show you how these people are being murdered by this numerical code. So you just go to Wikipedia, you look up his information. His Wikipedia page is also coded. See these recent deaths at the bottom? Those are also murders from the federal government. So he's born August 21st, you know, 218, the eclipse number. His death that very well was synced up with the 2017 total solar eclipse. And because he was born on, this, on the anniversary of that, well, not the anniversary of that, he was born the literally the day of that. But that happened in 2017. He was born in 1961. Fifty-six. On his fifty-sixth birthday, it happened. He now dies on fifty-six date with numerology. So very interesting. So now I'm really curious to see from the eclipse to the day he died. 
If you'd like more information on this, please check out Gamationator85, the man who made this calculator, very good, very good person. And he also has a channel, he has a blog, he shares this information very nicely. So please check out Gamationator85, and he tells you about all these eclipse sacrifices in the media. And this is what I'm saying. Well, from the, from the, he died 97 days from his birthday. We'll get to this. Cause I didn't do 2017, but that's very relevant. He died 97 days from his birthday. Death equals 97. Also a span of 14 weeks, dead 14 and 14, 66 weeks. Exactly. 66 weeks from the eclipse. He dies. Eclipse equals 33. When you're out 33, you get 66. Revelation, the 66 book of the Bible. Very good pairing with the eclipses. Eclipse 33. So 66 is a way to represent 33. T is the 20th letter. 2 plus 0 is 2. H is 8. Use Adam all. 66. Also, when you're three months, five days, one, three, five, like the key of David from the book of Revelation. Also, 15 months and six days. If you count the end date, 15 months and six days. Going back to our example, we wrote out 33, using not but a border, you get 156. And again, these are numbers for the eclipse. He's dying by these numbers. Society of Jesus equals 56, by the way. The Jesuit order are responsible. 463, let's look that up, the 90th prime number, what is the eclipse about? The sun, sun equals 9, which is just 90, and look how old he died, 57, moon, 57, sun, the moon, the earth, it's all a dance, earth has 83, the reflection of Earth also equals 38. So he dies on a date with 38 numerology because when we reverse H is the 19th letter, 1 plus 9 is 10. So reducing everything once, you get 38. So you see how they're pairing 38, they're pairing the numbers for moon, the numbers for sun, from when he died with the eclipse. He's born the date the eclipse was. You know, I should be watching more of Derek's videos. And I'm sure he probably does have a video on this and how is Eclipse Ritual. I mean, you can always check his channel. And you see how we're seeing this now, just doing this on the whim. And then here we go. So if you've been paying attention, what have we been talking about? They released the propaganda. So if I say he dies on this, these particular numbers, just understand these numbers are for the day they released the propaganda. He dies the 26th. Sacrifice 55, Saturn, Moon equal 21. It's the 300, he died on the 330th day of the year. See? For the eclipse, 33. It's very simple to see. But then they're, they're making it work. Sun equals 27 on the 27th of November. They're putting out propaganda about him dying. And they're putting it out on a date with 34 days remaining. Murder equals 34, as we've seen. Murder 34, 1234, see Nickelodeon is publishing this propaganda on Twitter. Nickelodeon is nothing else than a propaganda network. Nickelodeon equals 55, on a date with 55 numerology, Nickelodeon murdered Stephen Hillenburg. You see how Nickelodeon is nothing else than a murderous gang of Jesuits, Zionist Jews, Freemasons, Jesuit 21. Freemason 48, Jews 57, Reflection of 75, Israel 37. Those are also, there's also some killing numbers, you know, kill 28, 17. You know, the cast of all that, Amanda Bynes, anything you see in Nickelodeon, all these people, Keenan and Kel, they're all going to be murdered by the federal government. So if you like them so much, why not help me stop this gang? So that's pretty much it.
He told Variety at the time that he intended to work on the show for long as I am able. So when they put these things in these emphasis, it's going to have Gematria pattern matching what we've been looking at. Or the numbers for Freemasonry, just them branding their propaganda. 109, the 29th prime, a Sonic 29. 71, the 20th prime. Time 20, Sun's the keeper of time. Death equals 20. 170, sacrifice equals 170. This is a sacrifice. I just said he was sacrificed by Nickelodeon. And right in that phrase, they give you the number for sacrifice without reversing the output of order. So when we reverse it, A is 26, Z is 1, add them all, 170. And then what he said, for as long as I am able, 170, like sacrifice. 316 also connects to Jesus Christ. You know, he was sacrificed at 33. America 50. They said he died of ALS. 49. Died of ALS, which equals 49. And what do they, what do, they do? They published his propaganda date with 4922 numerology. He died of something that sums you 4922. This pattern is always so easy to see. Hillenburg. Guys, he was a Zionist Jew actor putting out Zionist Jew propaganda. You know, it's not hard to see. Yeah, SpongeBob can be funny. You can, you know, you can laugh at it. A lot of those laughs are at your expense. Hillenburg equals 108.54. Sun equals 18.54. See, we have the Sun numbers. You know, Free Masonic equals those. But we have the numbers for the Sun in his name. Hillenburg, double 54. Emphasize on the sun. Stephen equals 33. Again, Eclipse 33. Stephen equals 39. Also like Eclipse. Because again, when you reverse. S the 19th letter. 1 plus 9 is 10. 39. It's very easy to see the riddle here. And do you know how I saw it? It took no no time at all. All you all I saw was that he was born on August twenty first. That's all I have to see. That's it. It's it's over. Also in sixty one, that's the eighteenth prime. Again, sun equals eighteen. Emphasis on the sun. It's forwards and backwards, sums to eighteen, just like how his name sums to fifty four forwards and backwards. Eighteen. Sixty one is the eighteenth prime, born in nineteen sixty one. For the sun ritual put on by your federal government. Sun also equals 27. Again, on the 27th, they're re releasing that information. So, if anyone wants to come here and say this is after the fact, it's not. I said there's going to be a major death reported that day, and there was. Stephen McDaniel Hillenberg, 150, reversing and reducing once. Again, updating this piece of propaganda, 150. Illuminati equals 150. Catholic Church, 132. That's what's putting on this eclipse ritual. United States of America, 132. England, 132. Those are all Catholic Church countries. Illuminati equals 150 and 120. That's 273. I can't pinpoint it right now. America also equals 129. I can't pinpoint this 273 right now. It's not a prime number, nor do I think it's a triangular number. But, you know, maybe one day. McDaniel. I've never even seen that name spelled that way. 33. 48. 78. 165. Scottish right? 165, 78. Jesuit, 78. 33, 48. Remember, on the 330th day of the year, he dies on the 330th day of the year with 48 lifeless number. You see how the date he dies, the life path number, the day it was, matches with his middle name. You see how he has these tidbits of coding all in his name. You see how you cannot do this with anyone, anytime. Like when you die, or just go anyone who died in your family, go on, or your friends, or anyone you know. 
go and decode. You might find some things, you know, some organic things, but it will never be this clear. Anything written about them will not be this clear, this synced up. That's how you do it. You do a science experiment. That's why the people come and deny this. Like, I'm not sure what you're doing with your free time. It's so easy to figure this out and see how this, this is actually what's going on. Like, I don't care if you don't believe in what the federal government believes in, you know, that God created the world, combine the letter with the number, and using that knowledge, you can get more esoteric meaning. Who cares what you believe or they believe? This is what they this is what they believe, and this is how they play God over your lives. They say, okay, well, since God created the world that way, we're going to do the same exact way. We're, we're going to create their world using the same exact system that God's doing it. That's what happened. You know, they're crazy. They're doing it. Doesn't matter your justification, but that is what they're doing. Kelly Ripa, all these people, these are all theatrical actresses and actors for the Zionist Jew One World Order. You know, this Phil Dunphy looking actor right here in this bullshit Zionist Jew Freemasonic propaganda. So. You know, there's definitely more here. There's definitely more just like with the show, how it's coded, more SpongeBob connections to this that I just immediately didn't see right off the top of my head. But I can tell you right now, this the SpongeBob with the 41 connection, that was the total first total solar eclipse over the United States of America in 99 years. When you're out 13, you get 99. That's definitely part of that riddle. Real quick, let's just see if we if this riddle continues with this Jamal Khashoggi propaganda. Guys, if, you, if you're new to this channel, if you haven't been following this, this guy is a theatrical stage actor for the Zionist Jew Cabal. He's very well alive. This is just an actor from Mossad. They're putting on a play. You heard me correctly. Mossad, MI6, CIA, FBI. Those are theatrical performance companies. Just like you go to a play, it was put on by some production company and they you'll know, make money off their play that's exactly the type of world we live in that's exactly i use that word very specifically and carefully exactly what is going on you are literally living out a play why do you think i talk like this why do you think i call donald trump a saturnian philemic actor because exactly what it is that's all he's ever been you know philema 125 the reflection of this <laughs> Saturn 21, 439, Masonry 39, Zionism 39. I can't breathe. Jamal Khashoggi's last words to close in transcript sources say, guys, this is synced up with Eric Garner propaganda. I can tell you right now. We can see the date Eric Garner died to today. See if we get anything. I can't breathe equals 74, 218. See, 218. I just said, let's see if they continue the pattern. Here, 218, the eclipse on the 21st of August. Just the fact that we're getting this number again. Government 52, White House 5247, Prophecy 10652, giving you his little prophecy, his last words, you know, the prophecy numbers in this. And again, 74, like Masonic, like Jewish. So real quick, let's just look up Eric Garner. Maybe we won't, maybe we won't see anything, you know. But, guys, this, is, this stuff is always a riddle. It's always a puzzle. What, what did I just say? Jamal Khashoggi is an actor. This is a play. So, And if you watch any sort of anime, any sort of play, where things continue, later on in the series, they pay tribute to what happened earlier. That's what, exactly what they're doing. So he died, he died July 17th. You know, New World Order 170. Or, excuse me. It's, well, yeah, New World Order 177. I thought that was real quick but it's still 177 propaganda 177 propaganda and then we have to do this we have to do his birth numerology and see are there race coding numbers yes negro 32 they were 32 numerology. They were 24 numerology to reflection of 42. Nigger 42. Negro 32. 113 to Sonics, green screen, mainstream. But we'll stick to this. Also, born 15-9, 159, black man 159. He's literally a, the black man. 
who's being choked up by the NYPD. Guys, the whole Eric Garner thing was a fake news theatrical performance from the NYPD. Black man equals 159. Eric Garner born the 15th of September by the numbers. Scottish right also equals 159. With this I Can't Breathe propaganda event. So July 17th, 2014. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? You're living out a script, an act, 1,677 days, 167 is the 39th prime, 39 stamped on black people all the time. I just put up a my last video started off with that example. And you, <laughs> so if you're here from the last video, now do you see what I'm talking about? This is exactly what I mean. Masonry 39. Zionism, 39, federal, 39. Instead of me going through all the examples again, just go watch the beginning of my last video. You know, MLK, Malcolm X both dying at 39. See, they both, the two black men dying at 39. You see, at 39 years old. So the 39th prime from the day Eric Garner dies. Here we're now getting Jamal Khashoggi propaganda. Yeah, he's not black, but understand. It is clearly a ritual to that shit. I can't breathe. You know, propaganda, 90 theater reflection. Eric Garner. I'm trying to say it was, it was name sums too. Sacrifice 62. Route 13 at 99. But I, I find that very interesting. I don't know if 1,607 is a prime number. Oh, it's the 253rd prime number. And 253 is the 22nd triangular number. Negro 22. So Negro equals 22. And again, 32 is one day with 32 numerology. The sum of the numbers 1 through 22 gives you 253. So do you see they're, they're giving the numbers for Negro, the numbers for the 39. Love putting that on black people, as I've extensively documented. And now they're giving us I Can't Breathe, Jamal Khashoggi propaganda event today on 12 slash 9, America equals 129 in Jewish cipher. <laughs> and then Jamal Khashoggi equals 5976 like Negro. I mean, his name even has Negro numbers. Like, are you all seeing this right now? This is clear what they're doing. It's so easy to spot the riddles. And how do we spot this one? From this line of propaganda. I can't breathe. I mean, get the fuck out of here with this shit. It's so stupid. Black man also equals 21. I did a 521. Again, yeah, 439 in the video. I mean, I haven't said it's 439. I already called that out. I even like how it's initialized with 242, you know, nigger 42. See? They're attributing, paying tribute to that. And his name is Sumsu 59. Also 41. Yeah, 41. You know, Eric Garner born today with a lifeless number 41. It's like Khashoggi 41. I mean, guys, his name is Jamal. I mean, it's a very <laughs> common black name. Guys, his name is fucking Jamal. I mean, I don't know what else you need to see. This is clearly a racist ritual in tribute to Eric Garner. Eric Garner's just an actor for the federal government. Let's see from the anniversary of his death to the propaganda is coming out. Four months, 22 days. And they say Tannic Cypher. We read out 42. You get 422. And again, nigger equals 42. Catholic 145. Death 25. 20 weeks, 5 days. Upcoming anniversary, <laughs> 220 days, again, Negro 22. It's a, and it's a span of seven months, nine days. When you include the end date, it'll be seven months, nine days, 79 is the 22nd prime. So we got the 22 from the day it happened, the day he died up until now. We got the 22nd triangular number. Look at all the numbers we just seen for 22. Negro 22, we got the 79. 
It's 79 from the upcoming anniversary of his death. It's, you know, it's 253 from, from when he died. And then it's 220 weeks. This is just 22. I'm not making this up. 31 weeks and 3 days also. Like Knights Templar, 65. 313 is the 65th Prime. Jesuit, 78. Knights Templar, the military arm of the Catholic Church. Putting on this crop again. The NYPD is a theatrical performance troupe from the Knights Templar. They're doing the same shit they've always done. It's just New Age way of putting out Zionist Jew, fake news, Catholic propaganda. You know, slave 31, dies on a date with 31, life lesson number, Negro 22. Do you see how he died on a date with 22 numerology? As we've been just talking about this number, he died on July 17th. That's the day with 167 days remaining, the 39th prime. So 1,067 days later, or 1,607 days later, we now get this Jamal Khashoggi, I Can't Breathe propaganda, clearly synced up with Eric Garner. Also, you okay, 24C. Both dice 24, numerology, reflection 42, born and died. This is all numerological fake news propaganda. I, I can't explain it enough. You know, Freemasonry 58. So there you have it. You know, he was 43 years old. When you're out 42, you get 43. Killing also equals 43. When you're at 42, you also get 38, all the 30th you've seen, Killing 43, Masonic 43, NYPD sums you 23, and 49, again, he was, oh, <laughs> different piece of propaganda. But I understand Scottish 49, the Scottish Rate Freemason is putting all this on. Sacrifice 46, 199 to 46 Prime, NYPD putting all this prop beginning. NYPD 59, 23, Jamal Khashoggi 59, Negro 32, 59. I mean, do you see the pattern? 13. So fuck the police. They're a bunch of bullshit actors. They want to tyrannize you all day long. Peace out.